In this session, I will show you how to add the users to your Certify account. Select the configuration link on the upper right hand side. This will bring you to your system configuration page. In the user accounts and billing section, select create new users. Here you have two options. Create a user individually or create users using the bulk user upload tool. To enter a user individually, enter the user's email address. their first name, their last name, their employee ID, their role within Certify. Within Certify we have four roles. The employee role, which is someone who will be creating and submitting their own expense reports. The manager role, who can create and submit their own expense reports and approve expense reports. The executive role, who can create and submit their own expense reports approve expense reports, and have access to some company-wide reporting. And the accountant role, who can submit their own expense reports, approve expense reports, have access to those company-wide reporting tools, and process expense reports. You'll then select their department and choose Next to Save. The new user will be sent a welcome email with their username and password, and their account will be live. If using the locked approval workflow, once users are added to Certify, you will need to assign their approver, approval path by selecting Edit User Records. To add lots of users at once, select Bulk User Upload Tool. Here you'll copy and paste comma-separated values into the text box provided. The expected format for each line is the first name, last name, email address, department, employee ID, and employee type. Select Add These Users and choose Next to Save. The new user will be sent a welcome email with their username and password. By selecting Return to User List, you'll find your list of users. This will open up the User Details section so you can modify those user records. For additional resources, choose the support link at the top of your page. Here you have resources available with our frequently asked questions, the Certify Knowledge Base, and support here at Certify. Thank you.